how to connect Harpa AI to make.com. Now, that's what I'm going to show you guys in this pretty quick and easy video. Now, this is a step by step tutorial on how to actually do this. So keep watching and you will get there. Now, over here, I am currently in make.com. And if I click on this plus icon and search for um, Har Harpa, just like that, it will not show up in here. Now, how can we actually get this? Well, there's also a full on guide here how to actually connect it. But I'll show you guys how you can actually do this your self with this tutorial as well now i'm over here on an amazon product and let's say i want to track this price now i'm going to click on uh, the harpa ai tool right over there and click on monitor now this will scan a couple of different things that i would like to monitor so i'm going to monitor the price drop right here so we're going to click on there and what i actually want to do is click on the extra config this will enable this and here you will have um, first of all, the trigger. But this is something that you have to choose yourself. Now I'm going to select it, keep it on this. And then you want to go to actions and integrations. And here you can uh, enable make.com. So click on there, send on uh, task run or every trigger. So you can choose what this is. And here it will give you a brief explanation. Select how to dispatch actions on every trigger, the first trigger in a row or every time to task is run. Um, dispatching actions on the first trigger only will sign as consecutive actions until the trigger check fills. And here's also a limit, so you can keep it on do not limit. And then here you have to install the Harpa web monitor right over there. So I'm going to click on there, and now we can actually go ahead and install this. So install it, and then um, my organization, click on install, and then um, go to finish the dashboard. Then I'm going to actually refresh this real quick. So then we can actually search for Harpa. And there you go. It will now show up in here. Click the watch task finished. And it is now right over here. Now here we have to choose a hook. So um, I will just uh, click on add. Then I will just um, call this. Then click on save. Then you have to copy this link right over here. Which I'm going to do real quick copy it then go back and here you can actually go ahead and paste it in there now that we have pasted it in here we can actually go back and now we can actually click on run once and um, go ahead and go back click on recent test event and it says tested okay go back and it will now give us a check mark and yeah that's exactly what we want so that's basically how you can just add Harpa AI to make.com. I hope this video helped you out. Let me know in the comments if it did, and then I will see you next time.